Hey guys, back with another video for my addictive blogging channel and in this video I will be talking about the Alexa in the MSVG DS2 Mini. So Alexa has been there in this smartwatch and a few of the things have been changed from the time Alexa has been implemented in this smartwatch. So we will see what are the things that Alexa can do in the MSVG DS2 Mini and a lot of people are saying that Alexa is not showing full answers nowadays in the MSVG DS2 Mini. We will find out whether Alexa is showing full answers and is useful enough for day to day activities and what are the important things we can do with this Alexa in this smartwatch so as always this video will be a sick video guys and if you are a tech enthusiast don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and hit that bell notification up because I will be making more videos like this so let's start so I have with me the AMS Vigit S2 mini and we will connect the Alexa with the smartwatch first so to connect the Alexa, you have to come to the Zap app, which is the official app for the Amazfit watches. And once you are in the Zap app, you will be getting the option to connect Alexa. So, in the profile section, if you go to the watch Amazfit GTS 2 Mini, you will be getting the option of Amazon Alexa in here. To click that and click on agree and just log in with the Amazon details or credential you can say so if I am logging in with the Amazon credentials you will be seeing that I will be authorized and ready to use the Alexa in the Amazfit GTS 2 Mini it will take a while but sometimes it will give you an error also so if it is giving you any error you have to do one thing you have to retry login in with the Amazon Alexa so here I have to select not now and once I will be selecting not now you have to click on continue setup so here I have clicked on continue setup and you can see it directly locked in the Amazon Alexa in my Amazfit GTS 2 Mini. In case you are getting error, you have to just retry once more. And in case there are any issues, you can also create a different Amazon account and log in in the Amazon Alexa with that credentials. So once you are logged in into Alexa, you have to just swipe right and the Alexa will be activated and you can see Alexa is listening now. So we can do a lot of things with the Alexa and we will also see whether Alexa is showing the full answer. So first of all what we can do with Alexa is complicated calculations. So each and every calculation we can do like the square roots also. So if we find something like square root of 24. So you can see it is showing me the square root of 24. You can do multiple calculations, multiplications, divisions, additions, subtractions and also some percentage calculations in here. It is really great and it is giving you the answers at once. So next we can do is we can find places nearby. So places nearby can be very useful if you are in need of medicine. You can just ask Alexa something like medicine store near me and you will be getting the next medicine shop details. So if I ask something like medicine shop near me so you can see it is showing something like according to map my India found a nearby pharmacist there's heartbeat many shop which is 3.3 kilometers away although it is not showing the full information but definitely it is giving you the details of the nearby medicine shop which is located 0.3 kilometers away and it is also giving me the number which is the 422 so shop number also it is giving which is really really important and really useful in the time when you will be in need the third thing which alexa can do is alexa can set alarm set reminders do some basic tasks in this watch like setting alarm setting reminders setting to-do list or you can say giving you the weather giving you your location uh, something like that so set an alarm for tomorrow 8 30 a.m so you can see it directly sets the alarm and definitely it is very useful you don't need to take out your phone or you need to click some of the buttons in here you can directly do this with the help of Amazfit GTS 2 Mini definitely this is very useful and it is only a one time activity which will create the alarm and also you can set reminders like set a reminder that I need to go for a walk at 5.30 am tomorrow so 
so you can see this is a long uh, information which i have given to alexa and alexa has read that information and created a reminder also if we go to the to do list option you will be seeing that the reminder has been stored and in the future it is showing if i click on that i need to go for a walk even the time has been captured correctly by alexa which is really great because you don't need to go to to do list and add a reminder you can just tell alexa to set a reminder and that's it you are set for the day you can just keep reminders and whatever to do list task you want to do and just tell alexa for the whole day and you are set to go and ready to do the task for the whole day in the next 24 hours so once you have completed the task just click on that and tap on complete and it will remove the task again so which is really great and definitely it is a useful feature so alexa can do this type of thing so now let's see whether alexa can give us the full bit of information or not it can be really useful if we want to know some information which is required by us like typing in the google but just asking alexa so i will just ask alexa some of the information like what is the height of mount everest so you can see it is giving you the full information so it is showing you mount everest is 8848 meters above sea level and also it is giving you extra information so let's ask something which will be a little bit harder for alexa to understand also the information it will be a little bit longer in there who is steve jobs so this is information it is showing if i ask who is steve jobs it is showing like Stephen Paul Jones was an American business magnet, industrial designer and media proprietor and investor. He was co-founder, chairman and CEO of Apple, the chairman and so here is a problem because it is not showing the information fully because of the small screen. So at that point what can be done? Let's check out. Who is Steve Jobs? Show me the full information. Also, I have noticed that it shows different type of information at different times. So not always it will show you the same information. So the information at first it was shown from other website. Now it is shown from reference.com. So this is a thing with the Alexa. Whatever will be available in the first page, it will be displayed in the MSP GTS 2 Mini. So the next thing it can be useful for is we can know the time for other places or other countries. At the same time, we can convert basic things like temperature or from weight to pound like that what is the time in Canada so you can see it is showing me the time in Canada right now and I can do something like turn 25 degrees Celsius into Fahrenheit So it just gives you the correct information in here. It's super simple, super easy to convert anything with the Amazon Alexa. So this is the thing guys, if we want some important information with the Amazon Alexa in MSP GTS 2 Mini, we can get that. Definitely a very, very useful features. And if we want something like full information via the Alexa, that is not possible right now. So now let's see what it cannot do. So it cannot do some things like calling people or starting music. So this function is not supported. So this type of complicated things are not yet supported with Alexa. All the MSP is working on this in the future updates. So we have to wait for that whether these things will be added or not so these are the things which you can do with the amazon alexa and there are some few things which are not supported in the amazon alexa right now so i just wanted to tell you guys that the amazon alexa is useful in this watch and you can use it to get some important information it can be really useful at times so that's it guys i hope you have liked this video if you like this video don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and hit that bell notification up because i will be making more videos like this so thank you guys have a great day thank you Thank you.